Okay, lots of explanations, but it's important to know how to start the right way. Now let's go over what we're allowed to sell on Etsy, what we're not allowed to sell, so that this way we'll make sure to live up to Etsy standards and keep our seller account alive for a long, long time moving forward and simply stay here for the long run. So what exactly is it that we're allowed to sell on Etsy? Etsy is a marketplace that's focused primarily on handmade items, vintage and retro goods, craft supplies, and party favors. All of these can be split into different categories, such as jewelry, clothing, home goods, party invitations, gifts, etc. Now with dropshipping, it's easy to find suppliers that sell thousands and thousands and thousands of products under these categories. But on the other hand, you do not want to list items that are not handmade, vintage, retro, craft supplies, or party favors, even if you see other sellers who are doing it. Now, I even reached out myself to Etsy's customer support and I asked them, if this is what it says that we can sell in your policies, how come I can see sellers who are listing this and this and this and that, which have nothing to do with these items? And they simply got back to me and said, hey, you know, it's only a matter of time before we scan those seller sites and we shut them down. Sell only these types of items and that way you won't have any problems selling on Etsy. And that is what makes Etsy stand out. It is a handcraft, vintage, retro website or marketplace selling only these types of items. So for example, Etsy does not allow selling electronics, but I can still see sellers who are selling them. Now, some of them are trying to get smart by selling, for example, speakers that are retro speakers. So it's kind of a gray area, but I would say take no risks, stay under these categories. You have so many products in demand that you can sell under these categories, and I'm going to show you some of the best winning products soon.